Hello, my name is Alexandria Day, and I'm the founder and CEO of MetaBrain Labs. What we do at MetaBrain Labs is change mindsets. I come from a background of 18 years as a therapist, 18 years uh, developing software. What we believe in MetaBrain is our mindset determines our life experience, and it's grounded in cognitive behavioral therapy, neuroscience, and learning theory. What is a mindset? I'll give an example in sports. I get too nervous when people watch me. If someone has that belief, they will not end up on the podium. Those at work that hold themselves back because they think they have a deficiency, that's a barrier. And those that don't believe that anybody really wants them will probably leave them alone most of their life. So the bottom line is people can only rise to the level of their mindset. So we have a product in the Apple Store and Google Play. It's an app. It's a chatbot actually experience that's connected to a brainwave infused headset. We collect brainwaves during the chatbot experience, push them to our platform for analysis, and push the next question in the chatbot experience. So it's a neurotech infused chatbot that guides the user experience, and it's also a patent pending. This is an MVP release. So we have validation because when we're making claims that we can change a mindset in two weeks, we need numbers. We've got the numbers. We conducted a golf pilot we just came out of. We did a leadership training. And even leaders that are already functioning at a high level improved significantly. Our golf putting pilot that lasted two weeks of doing our process with that chatbot improved 32% on 20-foot putts, which is actually astounding. So how do we go to market? We're going to market with coaches. That is about a $35 billion industry. If you think about life coaches, golf coaches, sports, wellness, whatever, health. So it's a very big market, same process as we penetrate each one of those verticals. How we do it, we repurpose content that is already existing in the marketplace and deliver it in the chatbot experience. Our coaches help their users identify goals and obstacles, assign programs so that they can change their mindsets quickly and then repeat the process again. So we have a B2B SaaS uh, model, coach-led mindset reset programs. We provide the neurotech tools to assess, identify, and change mindsets. The QA chatbot delivers the coach's content or other licensed content from other professionals um, that we repurpose. And then we do massive data collection and analysis for continual invention. So our revenue model is we have a subscription-based model but for the users. Once we get good traction, coaches begin to pay subscriptions for tiers of other features. And then we have headset sales. We are a reseller of a manufacturer uh, that produces headsets um, for others, but we've integrated with it. Our product will integrate with any headset that collects brainwaves. So our go-to-market is recruit, publish, and empower coaches. So we are working with any coach, all ilks. We purpose and publish the content in the chatbot QA format. We train and certify coaches to guide, support, and hold users accountable. Our competitive analysis shows that Muse and Mindy, as well as ourselves, are using brainwave analysis as part of the product. The difference between us and them is we're looking for the resolution. Why do I feel the way I feel? Change it, and then I feel differently, and I behave differently. Muse and Mindy are just trying to calm after the fact, so it's only momentary relief. CBT. I love it, but it takes too long, costs too much money, and the 50% success rate after $2,500. Books, learning, many of those books just sit on shelves. People lack the motivation to follow through. I've wrapped myself with a team that can go to market. I can continue to invent, listen to customers, tweak, listen to customers, tweak as we make the product better. I've got a stellar team, and even behind this, I have an ethics uh, council that even boasts uh, the AI director from Kaiser Permanente. We're asking for $2.5 million to 
get things going, priced round. And um, we invite you to join us. Financial projections right now, this is kind of working around our, our development needs that are going to require some AI. So chances are we'll need to do another round in about a year. But we do generate quite a bit of revenue and it grows very quickly. Um, our exit strategy is acquisitions, and we believe we have at least four sports, enterprise, home, healthcare, therapeutic. We have the platform that is the future of the pocket therapist. And then data, data wins. So we are collecting lots of data on human behavior, personalities, with the goal to map personality to the genome to predict disease conditions and better to change the course by changing um, the mindset. So our use of funds is to expand the executive team, AI capital investment, as I mentioned, R&D, I want to continue R&D, um, build the sales team and marketing so we can get out there. So to close out this, I just say that um, a better life experience creates a better world. And this is the reason we help people change their mindsets. Thank you.